This is the address book allow list feature. You can access it from your general settings page on the left hand side. And it pretty much does what it says on the tin. So in this particular case, I have this feature enabled. And by the way, to enable and disable this feature, you have to go through a verification process. You can't just switch it on and off as you go. This is on now. And in order to switch it off, it has some effort you have to go through. You have to verify it. But essentially, in my case, I don't want to send crypto out to anything anymore. I just want to keep it all in Coinbase. So I have this feature enabled and I have no addresses added. This means that no addresses will be accepted to send crypto out to because none of them are added in the approved or allowed addresses. Now, to add a new address, it takes 48 hours. The address will go for a pending stage of 48 hours before it's officially allowed to be an address if you do want to add addresses. What this means is if you keep checking this page every day, you can actually see any pending addresses. And let's say someone did manage to get into your account and add a malicious address, you could catch that and get rid of it because you can recognize it's not yours. Also, I believe you get an email when a new address is added. But the fact that there's a 48 hour lag period means that you can always stay on top of the addresses that are being added or removed. So I think this is an absolutely essential security feature that's not talked about enough. This will save you. This can be used to make sure that no malicious addresses are ever added to your account. And as I mentioned before, the 48 hour period is so good. That gives you all the time to closely monitor which addresses are being used. So I would highly recommend you enable this. If you are sending loads of stuff out to different wallets and exchanges, that will add a little bit of a roadblock because obviously you're going to have to manually add each address. That might be quite inconvenient, so you might want to weigh up if that's worth putting in or not, if that's worth using this feature. But if you only send crypto out every so often, this is an absolute must to make sure and add that extra crucial step to make sure attackers don't drain your account.